Hey everyone, Riley here from becominganelectrician.com. In this video, I wanna talk about um, always double checking the other side of the wood before you actually drill, all right? I can't tell you how important this is. You never drill blindly, and I'll just give you a little example in this video, all right? A couple things you have to think about when you see wires is, you know, like the top plate. As soon as you see a top plate that's a red flag, be careful, you know, wires can be anywhere on the other side here, so always be careful, all right? In this case, there is no wires in this area, okay? I just built this custom wall here as I was doing my rough in series for you there. I'll leave that link in the description if you wanna check that out. Um, I just, we're gonna to go to the shed where there's more wires where I can share examples for you. All right, so as you can see, we have a wire coming here, all right? And then the wire will go down, that's providing power comes down here into a box and then it's going to come back up for our light all right so as you can see we have our wire right here now in this case it's really easy to see because these are considered a support whenever we drill a hole it's considered a support so we don't need to put a staple anywhere here right in this case because there's no support we have to actually have a staple okay so again this is considered a support and it's nice and easy to see the wire but when the wire is running with the board, okay? When it's running with the board, people are stapling and you're not able to see on the other side of the stud. And what happens is people get lazy, they start drilling and they just go for it. But always, 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 always put your hand at least on here, make sure nothing is there. Usually you wanna do a visual check. And the wisest thing to do before you actually start drilling your holes is actually to go into the room or you know wherever you're going to be drilling and actually go on both sides and you would look on both sides all right and you kind of just get an idea and then you know okay now you can drill your holes and you're good to go because when you work in a condo or in a home there's not just wires there can be plumbing pipes sprinkler pipes imagine hitting a wire feeder for the home <laughs> that's not cheap right under the stairs here from just like the last video, I just wanted to share some horizontal examples of things that you could be hitting if you're not careful. So you can see we have water lines here and this right here is like all the water lines for the home. So one wrong move, that would be a huge mistake, right? Same here, we have um, the wire going horizontal. So again, you just always wanna go into the area, check the other side of the joist and just really make sure there's nothing there, okay? So that is it for this video. If you guys wanna stay updated with the website, becominganelectrician.com, you guys can visit me over at becominganelectrician.com forward slash subscribe to get my free book. You will get my free electrical book for apprentices and you'll stay updated on the website with new tutorials and videos like this. I'll talk to you in the next one.